More D3 action. Tiffin Regional at Frost Colonel Stadium. Liberty Benton's Austin Combs in the shot put. School record, 56 feet 11 inches as he takes first place at the regional meet. Lipstick Holly Averish now in the discus, going 142 feet 10 inches. Averish would win in the discus. Hard Northern now, Mackenzie Shepard, pole vault. As Shepard would clear 11 feet, she finishes in second. She'll be going on to Jesse Owens Stadium next week. Girls 100 now. Upper Scioto Valley's Brittany Holbrook finishes first with Wayne Trace's Monique Goings fourth, earning a trip to the state. Boys 100 meter dash, Corey Rawson's Mason Warnemark taking gold in 10.99 seconds. He had a big day for the Fighting Hornets. Girls 4 by 200, Wayne Trace's Monique Goings finishing second, Columbus Grove's Bailey Dunifern finishing in third for the Bulldogs. Boys 4 by 2. Bluffton's anchored by Dylan Alt. He takes first as Corey Rawson in second with Mason Warnemark the anchor. Girls 4 by 100 relay. And it's Wayne Trace's Goings finishing third. Columbus Grove anchored by Sarah Schrader finishing fourth. Good for a trip to the state finally. Boys 4 by 100. Tenora's Riley Nagel leading the Rams to first place. Finish Bluffton's Dylan Alt in second, followed by Corey Rawson and Mason Warner in third place. As we look at the team results from Tiffin, Archbold, your regional champion for the ladies. Columbus Grove finishing in sixth. USV and Lipsick uh, top eight performances as well for the guys. Number one, Columbus Grove, another regional championship for the Bulldogs as Bluffton and Corey Rawson tie for fifth. Liberty Benton, Arcadia, top ten performances as well.